Hey guys, so I wanted to make a wish party decor haul just because when I got introduced into this wish world, um, I kind of thought it was too good to be true. And I didn't really believe that you were going to get decent quality items for the price that you're paying. So I wanted to make this video because I did look online, I did go on YouTube, and there was a lot of hauls, but it was mainly like clothes, gym wear, um, I don't know, like home kitchen things, kitchen gadgets and stuff like that. Now, now those things are cool. But I think party decor is one of the best things that you can get on Wish just because you can get the exact same balloon or like exact same item or something even better. And it's over, it's like $20 at the store just because, I don't know, it's overpriced. And you can pay like $3 at Wish. The only thing is that you have to wait a couple weeks. It does take, some things take like a month or like a couple weeks some things if the seller is really good then they will ship it immediately and you will get it within like two weeks which I don't think it's bad at all especially for the money that you are paying so I am planning my daughter's first birthday party and her theme is kind of like pineapples flamingos I'll post a picture here where I got like my inspiration from but um like I wasn't gonna pay for things I'm kind of like a very like budget friendly type of person and I feel like you can if you do your research and stuff like that you can find things that are not like expensive that you don't have to go hire a party planner or something like that and pay like tons of money you can do it yourself or you can buy things from like wish as long as you like plan ahead of time then I mean you're good right so when I was planning her birthday and like looking through things to buy like through Amazon or I went to Target and stuff like that um I actually found the exact same items that I found on Pinterest on Wish and I was kind of like skeptical because I didn't know like how good they were going to be just because you pay a couple dollars compared to like a Target or Amazon you pay like fifteen dollars so I decided to buy a couple things first and then see how they were going to be so I think one of the first purchases that I bought was a cake topper and it just looks like this. It just says one. I wanted something simple. I didn't want anything that was like weird or whatever. And I saw this. I think this was like $2. I think it was a dollar. No, it was free. And then I paid $2 for shipping. And I mean, it's pretty decent. She's only going to use the cake topper once. So yeah, and it's like this foam material. And it's very like flexible and it has these two clear toothpicks right here and I think it's pretty good for the two dollars that I spent the next thing that I bought was balloons just because I wanted big flamingo and pineapple balloons and when I went to the store I think I went to Party City or I checked online and then I also checked on Amazon and I'm not lying they were like 13 15 dollars so I found the same exact balloons from wish and they look like this <laughs> It's a big old flamingo balloon, and I think I paid $2 for this, and I think it was like $2 shipping, and I might be, instead of me guessing the prices, I'm just going to like write them on the screen so I know that it's accurate and stuff like that. Now, the thing about Wish is that you'll find the same item, the same exact thing, and one will be free, one will be $2, one will be $1, one will be $7, and stuff like that, and... Um, I just decided to go with the cheaper thing. I kind of had like my own technique with shopping through Wish because I did see hauls online where it was like, um, this is not what I ordered, this is not what it looks like and stuff like that. So my tip when you're shopping through Wish is you look at something and you compare the prices. That's my first thing. So usually I'm going to choose something that's free or something that's like a dollar or two dollars. And then um, in the corner you kind of have like their reviews and their customer view, reviews and then you can also submit photos so once you receive your item you like the buyer sends a photo in and you kind of get points for extra discounts so, so a lot of people actually do take photos of their item or um, they just write like a review or you can actually like like video your item and stuff like that if I find that something is cheaper but there's no reviews or there's just store reviews so it's like kind of like like an Etsy shop like they sell like miscellaneous things and it's, it's not about that specific item the review then I usually won't get it I also read the description of the item because sometimes they'll say like um, let's see 
like I got these flamingo things right here and um sometimes they'll just say like one flamingo and then on the photo it has like three so you're expecting three flamingos but you're actually only going to get one I actually got two of the same ones because the other one I didn't re I think I was supposed to receive it maybe like in a month and it was like a month and a half and it still wasn't here and then when I tried to track my shipping it was kind of like lost in a way so I contacted Wish and I was like hey where's my order and they have so far they have great customer service and they actually gave me a refund and I kept the balloon and I actually wanted I didn't know if I was gonna get the balloon so I actually bought another one so now I have two the next thing that I bought from Wish was a pineapple balloon, and I thought this one was so cute, and it's just as big as that flamingo balloon, and I was very impressed, and I'll just write the price here because I don't remember what, it, like, how much I paid for shipping and stuff like that. So another thing that I bought from Wish for her birthday party are these twinkle lights right here, and I don't know if you, they're pretty bright actually. Um, so I bought four of these. And one of them does not work like the battery I think died or something so I'll just have to replace the battery but I think they're pretty good they're pretty decent you get to choose the store that I uh, bought from you get to choose like different colors and I just chose like this warm like yellow golden color next item that I got were these palm tree leaves and they come in a pack of three four five six seven eight they come in a pack of ten and um, yeah, they're pretty good quality. I kind of wanted to do some table decor with these. Um, I only bought one just because I didn't know how shiny and cheap they were going to look. But they're pretty decent and I kind of wish I bought another one. It's kind of too late now. It's not going to get here in time if I buy it. But yeah, and then they're actually really flexible like this and they're pretty cool. So yeah. The second to last thing that I bought from Lish for her party decor is actually this banner. It's flamingos and pineapples and it's kind of like this felt like material it looks like this flamingo and then the pineapple and they have little holes like right here and then it comes with the string and you kind of put it together like in a banner and stuff like that I'm gonna use this to decorate her um, high chair so yeah that was pretty cool I was actually really impressed by this because it's a lot bigger than I actually thought it was going to be. It's like about the size of my hand. So this is her, um, or this is the last thing that I, get, that I got. I actually got this yesterday in the mail. And they're like the little inflatable like um, flamingo things. I actually saw these at Target, I think the other day. And they were $5 for one. And then I didn't see anything at the dollar store. But I, I remember paying a dollar for two of these. And I think it was like a dollar or two dollars for shipping, so it's not bad. And these did kind of smell like chemically, like plastic stuff, but whatever. I'm not going to, no one's going to ingest this and no one's going to be like licking this and stuff. So I don't mind. I don't know if you're the type of person that minds. I don't mind. And they're pretty good quality. And yeah. I actually have another set coming in the mail. I ordered two of these to put on the table and stuff. So I decided to buy her birthday outfit from Wish, and I know it's tricky buying clothes from Wish because you don't know how the sizing is going to be, you don't know like how rough it's going to feel, how it's going to smell and stuff like that. I have seen some pretty bad reviews about clothing, so I just, I, I don't know, I decided to buy her outfit and I decided to buy it ahead of time just in case like something bad happened, then I could just go to the store and buy her outfit. So I got her this shirt like this which I thought was pretty cute and then it comes with this little plaid like a uh, skirt I guess because it has like little shorts and stuff I read the sizing chart and I got 18 months just in case just because I know like the sizing can be a little off and I haven't tried it on her yet but if it's too big I mean it's pretty cute there's nothing wrong with it. I'm just going to wash it before. And yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with my purchase. So yeah, I'm pretty excited now that I know that I can buy really cheap decor, but it's going to be good quality. Again, I'm always going to read the reviews. I'm always going to read the description um, just in case anything, you know, I don't, I don't want to waste my money, even though it's like $2. I still don't want to waste my money and wait the time to get like a really bad item. 
but so far I haven't had any bad experiences. They've all been good. I've been actually surprised at how good they are. I'm also going to make a video about how to make a birthday party on a budget because I wasn't for spending a lot of money for my daughter's first birthday party. She's not going to remember it. So if you're interested in seeing how I decorated on a budget and how I put everything together, um, I'll put a card up here or the video will be down below. I don't know which one is going up first, but that video I'm actually really excited um, to film because I'm excited to put everything up and stuff. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.